Hello everyone, hope you guys are doing well. So we are back with the long dark. It's been a little while since the long dark video. Um, since I've done a long dark video, I've been pretty sick for like a while. <laughs> um, but we are back and I desperately need some food and I have been seeing all of the comments about there possibly being a bedroll outside, um, at the back of the um oh god what do you call it the dam but because i desperately need some food at the moment i'm going to cook up some of this a bunny and we're gonna eat that and then i will slowly make my way back to the dam and hopefully we can check out back and hopefully <laughs> there will be a very much more um bedroll in the cave out there and uh, let's use it's been so long i am forgetting everything i'm like hitting my mic i'm doing everything wrong and i completely forgot that this is um this is interloper <laughs> this is interloper so we gotta be um we gotta be careful. Oh yeah, I also have some birch curing here and I have some maple back at um, one of the trailers just outside of the cabin. Oh sorry, the hydro dam, which is- uh, why do I have so many freaking cooking pots? Which is gonna be really good because there is also a hammer there. I am still really considering, once I've checked the place of the bedroll, I'm considering going to the Rickon, which would mean we'd have to go to uh, Coastal Highway, which for me is fine because I quite like Coastal Highway, um, but we have a bunch of birch, um, and then I have some maple, so all I really need is some arrows and that'll be like good by the time like we get back here maybe and then also I definitely need to make an improvised knife or two or <laughs> a couple um but yeah um one of you also mentioned that yeah we can break down some of the stuff with a heavy hammer that we would normally need a hacksaw for so that's good so i'm just gonna break this down um can i break down this as well sweet because i need some reclaimed wood so let's start a fire hopefully with this and i managed to get some bunnies in the end of the last episode so we don't want to do that we don't want that we will do some reclaim wait did i really not get a lot of reclaimed wood from that okay anyway uh 12 minutes and 12 minutes I take 45 minutes for four oof 22 minutes for two okay oh no i didn't want to do that it's been so long it was probably such a bad idea to um no but yeah it was probably such a bad idea to come back straight with interloper <laughs> honestly it probably was but we have it now so Oh my gosh, why do I keep picking it up? Do you think I should take one with me? And do you also think I should cook? Because I don't know if cooked meat also gives you a scent meter. Oh, okay, I have, I have one scent meter. So maybe cooked meat does. Okay, I didn't realise that cooked meat actually did as well, so. I also, now then, don't know whether to... Okay, now i got two centimetres. I'm stinky. <laughs> oh yeah, we also got some guts, um, which would be good for snaring some bunnies, maybe. Let's add a little bit more fuel to this. 
and let's cook that. So it's almost night time so I think what I will do is I will just hang about here. What is this? That's coal. Okay and then we got some guts here and some bunnies. Some little bun bu Oh! I don't know. Okay, I need guts and rabbit for that. Okay, um, until burn. I might as well just put on some water while we're here. I don't think it will be done in time. Or, yeah, before like the fire goes out or whatever, but. It'll be okay. Um, so yeah, I think we will eat some of the bunny before we go to bed. Because we have 220 to that one. And that one's only 160. So I think this bit here will be like the best bit. Um, oh, there's some cloth up here. Do I need to make anything? 22 minutes until ready. I'm just going to pass time. Let me just add that. So I've got a bunch of torches here at the moment. And one of the comments also mentioned that you drop a lit torch and then you light a new torch with that dropped torch. Which definitely makes a lot of sense. Um, but whether I remember to do it or not, we will find out. Um, okay, so I'm just going to nip outside. Oh gosh, berry boy is over there. Um, I'm going to drop off. Do I have any? Why is he like constantly coming over here? I don't have any scent meters on me, with me. And I kind of really wanted to go and like search a few areas. I swear I never used to like see him walk around this area this much. Actually, I don't think I've ever seen him over here. Which, I mean, I'm really not enjoying seeing him over here. But... It is what it is. Oh, I don't know if he's gonna like see me. Okay, it's too close for comfort, like I'm too scared. <laughs> Should I go into- see, because another thing, let's buy this cave. I was really tempted to go inside and just see if we could- Is he smelling me? Just see if we could um, get some more coal or stuff like that. There's some twigs over there. I don't know exactly like where he goes, whether he makes like a little circuit or what. Why does he look so much scarier? Okay, so grabbing X amount of cooked meat gives you a centimeter, which not great, but I need to eat anyway, so uh, until it boil dry, we'll take this until boil dry. We'll just do this. I probably won't uh, be cooked anyway, but... Right, so we have a bunch of water. Um, I feel like I'm going to die. I just... I, I can just, like, literally feel it. <laughs> I can just literally feel it. Right, I'm going to leave... the lump of coal here. I really, as much as I want to survey, oh yes, okay, we have a bunch of feathers in here as well. Okay, I need to make a little note inside the, um, inside this, like general note things. Okay, um, oh, I should also maybe put rabbit hides and some guts as well. Okay, 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 okay. Do I? Can I? I'm going to drop off the hammer here. Because there's already a hammer at the dam and I don't think we will need it. I'm going to take one cooking pot 
with me. I feel like maybe I should harvest up this. My health going down. I don't know. But right, what I'm going to do is I'm going to drink some water as it is night time and we are going to eat the rabbit. I'm going to eat a fair amount of it, maybe three or four pieces, and then we're going to go to sleep. Should I do another one? I don't know what's the best thing. I know it's best to eat before you go to sleep. But... How much? I do not know. Okay. So let's sleep for... I can't remember what one of the comments said. I think it was no more than eight hours. So I'm going to try... Was it eight or five? Oh gosh, I probably should have had a look. We're gonna try six, okay? <laughs> okay, right. We woke up fully rested. The food isn't great, but it's okay. I think what I might possibly do. I need to eat soon. No, girl, we ate before we went to sleep. We're fine. Um, yeah, I think what I might do. I might take this with me. I don't know if I should take all of those stones. Um, hum, 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 hum. Um, is it good to tear down the stuff that you don't need? Seeing it. Oh, yes, we also picked up a pry bar, didn't we? Oh, and we have birch, so I can make some birch tea. What's the heaviest thing? Water. Okay. I'm going to drop one here. Um, have bandages. I need leather for those. Should I do an hour of this? No, it's too dark. Okay, it's coming up morning time. So I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave. Oh gosh, I do we leave? Oh gosh. I <laughs> Why am I so like bad at this? Okay, can I read All out I here? Think about his food. Oh shit, I did not I completely neglected my heat. My fingers feel numb. I can't believe I did that. I can't believe I did that. Okay, we're gonna sleep for two hours. I'm not tired enough. Okay, we'll pass time then. And then sleep for an hour? Gosh. That feeds. <laughs> I can't help but like laugh because I'm doing so bad. I mean, I, I don't know. I'm, I'm doing okay, I guess. Part of me really, really wants to take this meat with me. This pack is getting kind of heavy. Okay, no scent meter. No scent meter. But we are getting cold. But I really need to get back over to the dam. Because that is obviously oh, where you guys keep like telling me pit. that there is a bedroll. And we definitely need a bedroll so that I can venture off a little bit more and at least like if we go inside a cabin or something that doesn't have a bed but I need to sleep I can sleep if need be because we've survived so far six days without a bedroll and I don't know if that I really want to go in here but I also oh should I the thing about the torches as well that the wolves won't come near you if you have a torch. Okay, Berry Boy is over that way. So I'm going to try and go around. Uh, 
and hope that he doesn't see me because if he sees me then we are definitely doomed so I think I'm far away from him now I'm gonna nip into the cabin um, our favorite cabin we're gonna nip into there maybe I should probably make some like birch tea or something because I, I have a lot of birch part of me is also really tempted to oh there's some bunnies over here okay, my gosh like in the last episode that I actually put up with this the uh, bit where I was trying to throw the stones at the bunnies and I just couldn't pick up the bunnies I don't know how much of that I actually put in but I must have honestly knocked out about six or so bunnies and each time I went to go pick them up it was just like nah so I was like hell no you are not getting <laughs> you're not getting the food today so I was just like oh okay I got so annoyed with it okay if, uh, risk hypothermia it's fine it's fine we just gotta get to the cabin that's all we gotta get to probably should pick up some sticks along the way the cabin also doesn't have anything in it. I don't know if it has any wood. Um, I honestly cannot remember what I left there, but my health's going down. But I am pleased that we managed to get our health back all the way up. So, a little bit of silver lining. Just hopefully we can get to the Mystery Lake camp office before we die we did go up there as well in the last episode so i can't remember if i left anything up there i should really before i leave off every every like area make a note either in a roll book <laughs> or make a little note in the book like the notes place in game i definitely do not want to get hypothermia Oh no, sorry, I don't wanna get frost well, I don't wanna get hypothermic, but I don't want frostbite. Especially not on this game. Cause if I get frostbite on this game I think we can safely call it game over. Oh I wanna chop this down so bad, but I can't. I think as well we're doing um or we have to we have to do this starvation technique thing where we like starve during the day but then we eat at night before we go to sleep okay let's warm up in here slowly but surely i can't break i should have brought the hammer with me why did i leave it over there I can use my hands to break down this though, so let's do that. I need to hatch it, that's empty. Um, can I break down this? Oh, I can. Okie dokie. Oh right, there is a burnt out flare there. I have a lot of birch. A lot, a lot of birch. Tinder plug. Let's craft some tinder plugs because obviously we don't have that up. Um, should I craft some birch box? Because we could make some tea. It just requires. And then what does the relish do? To make a natural drink with healing properties. Um, and then. Oh okay so birch bark is. The re restorative one. <laughs> I thought it was like the other way around. Okay. Um, repair skill increased to 71. 
so random, but okie dokie. Not gonna complain. Okay, we can only add fuel. I was hoping that we could um, take another torch. But we'll leave that going like that. Um, and then... Um, yeah, I don't really know what else to do. I have eight matches left and one flare. I'm going to drink a cup of coffee. And I'm going to see if we can head... Oh, should I take the shortcut? Do you think I should? I'm going to actually see if we can take the shortcut. Hopefully we can. I've got to as well remember not to aim at the wolves, otherwise they then start to charge. I also want to try and keep these videos interesting, so if they get pretty long, I apologise, but I hope you guys enjoy them. Cat's tails for food, definitely. I'll take the heads as well. I can't remember what way it was. Or was it this way? I feel like I'm just going to run into a bunch of wolves. Was it this way? We're getting really cold again, so... I feel like I'm going to make an arrow. Like I'm gonna, I'm gonna make a bow and arrow, and then we're gonna die. Okay, yeah, it was this way. Though I do think that there is a wolf hanging about around here somewhere, because there was a deer carcass. I do have food on me. I do have those two pieces of deer meat, um, but also trying not to eat them. I take this stuff? Oh, there's mountain rope here. Where the heck does that go? I have no idea, but I don't think I'll be able to climb it at the moment in any way. I'm going to leave those rose hips there. Also, there's an auto walk. I don't know if I said this in the last episode, but there's an auto walk. And my goodness, is that going to come in so handy? Okay, there's bunnies around here. Take some sticks as well. <laughs> I would totally get the bunnies, but I don't think I have spare time at the moment. Where does this place lead? No, no, no. I want this. I think there's some more cat's tails up there, but I, honestly I'm going to leave it because I'd rather not freeze to death. I'll just take these ones. Oh, was it around here that there was that? Oh, I think it was around here. Because there's like a little hunter's area. I didn't check it out the last time we come around here, so I need to find some kind of tempted to, to check cold. it out now. There is a deer there. And another one over there. Oh, it's be really tempted to harvest it. 
Oh wow, okay. A pry bar, a broken MRA, great. <laughs> I got really excited then. Nothing actually around here. I don't need the pry bar. Um oh it's so tempting. Because I could light a little fire next to it, but I am not. I feel like that's kind of risky. How much meat does it have on it, actually? Let's check how much meat it has. 0 0.9. I don't honestly think that it's worth it. So we're gonna leave it. I think the wolf must have just like gobbled it all up. <laughs> okay. We can do this. Our health's gone down, but... It's okay. I think that maybe this way is better um, than going across the actual like train line. What is that? Is that a dead guy? I think I searched that dead guy already. So I'm not going to bother. Oh, there's some more cattails there that I have missed. But currently we're freezing, so... Oh gosh. I just need to get into the dam. Please excuse me. Oh gosh, this is horrifying. Why? He was coming so close. Yeah, stay away from me. <laughs> stay away, stay away. Okay, we're back at the dam, we're back at the dam. I really, really do hope there is a bedroll out here. Really, really do hope. And the matches would be really good because at the moment, I just wasted one. And I think now I've... Okay, these are almost cured. Almost cured sticks and guts. I'm gonna try. I don't think I'll be able to. Because I think that this is gonna run out by the time we get out there, but. Yeah, I don't think this is gonna work. Okay, I think what I'm gonna do is. Oh, we left a bunch of stuff here. I am going to start a fire here. Just um, because I need to warm up and we're obviously we're going to be going back outside again anyway. So we're going to get really cold. 45 minutes until boil dry. Okay, right. I'm just going to make a beeline for the... Oh, I can also break down a bunch of those with the hammer that is out the front. So yeah, I'm going to try and make a beeline for this cave and just a hope that it is here <laughs> oh gosh please let it be there okay okay nothing 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 Nothing. Oh no. I bet that... Or oh, does it have... I don't know. I don't know if that's actually going to have anything in it. Because the last time I like moved something because of a hidden container there was absolutely nothing in it. There was nothing in it whatsoever. Oh no, that was the pry bar, wasn't it? We got the pry bar and I pried open the thing in the trapper's place. Okay, weak. And there was absolutely nothing. <laughs> there was nothing. Okay, so where is this cave? I think I remember.
but I'm not super sure. Is it over that way? Oh, there's also a deer carcass here. Oh, I'm gonna have to go around to get to it. Okay, um, we're gonna need this, no doubt. But there's cat's tails and some bunnies. Maybe I can avoid the wolf at all costs, but I don't know if this will be avoiding the cave as well. I think this is gonna hurt. Okay, okay. this way. I think it's the, I think it's this cave. <sighs> this one right here. Because if so we could try and kill some of these bunnies as well. I know it's not so good because the wolf is over there and he'll like scent us or whatever but please have a bedroll. <laughs> please have a bedroll. I see something. <gasps> yes! I love you guys. I love you guys so much. Oh my god. I did, wouldn't never have thought of coming over here because of a bedroll. I never would have thought that a bedroll would have spawned. And some tin goods and accelerant. This looks okay. Weird. Okay. Note to self. Note to self. This is a good place. Okay, so we're warming up. I'm actually thinking of maybe spending the night in here. Maybe trying to get some bunnies um, because then we can harvest them. Okay, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave the bunny here and I'm actually going to... Oh gosh, no, because I'm going to get really tired. Okay, I'm going to drink this cup of coffee. I'm going to leave the bunny here. Um, that's empty. I'm gonna grab one of these. Man, and rest soon I'm enough. going to head back just because I don't want to spend the night out here. And I think it'd be better for us if we headed back and then possibly I could try and if there is a deer over the other side then I can try and harvest that deer at least that way the wolf won't be like if the wolf uh, get the scent made or the wolf won't like find me Or maybe I could harvest the one that's over this way. I don't know. Because I'm also getting quite tired. So it's... We got a better roll though. So I'm happy. I just need to find somewhere where I can leave this off. And like be happy about it. <laughs> be happy and feel slightly I think safe. my stomach is eating itself. Yeah, I know. I don't know if it would be a good idea to like start a fire... Because I really need some more matches, that's the other thing. I feel like I've been going through my matches too easily. I'll see how much meat this guy's got on him. 0 0.5, that is less than the one had in the other area, so... I'm gonna leave it. I don't know if I can afford to be like this picky. 
but we're gonna leave it. And if there is one over the other side, then I might harvest it anyway, especially for its hide at least, and the guts, and then whatever meat is left. But I don't know if I'll be able to get it all done like now. Um, because we are really hungry and really tired. Okay, there's some crows over there, so I believe that there is... There is a deer over there. Okay, I've got to turn off the auto walk, because otherwise I will go straight over it. And that's the other thing, I don't know whether to take any metal I find, like, here over to the Rickon or whether to just try and get all the metal while we're over there. I feel like that might be the better idea because otherwise we're dragging around a lot of maybe unnecessary weight but then I think if I can't find anything metal over there. I believe I have a hacksaw. Yeah I do. Oh no no no. Let's check on this deer. But first, I think I'm going to check to see if there's anything around here. As far as I'm aware, I don't think I've ever found anything around this area. Like, ever. Thing. I was maybe hoping for some like hidden matches or something. <laughs> that would be good. Okay, let's check this guy out. So tired. I okay, 1.5. That's actually pretty good. So I'm gonna two hours. We'll see what happens here. The sun is setting. It's gonna get a lot colder soon. Okay, cool. I got two centimeters, which is fine. We're very tired. My health is going down. But now we have a bedroll, so I can literally just like hop in here and I can eat, and then I think I will just sleep. Okay, let's pop this down here. And I'm gonna try seven hours this time. But what I will also do, I'm gonna leave this video here. Thank you guys so, so much for watching. Thank you so, so much for telling me about the bedroll in the cave. I honestly, I would never have thought that that is where, like, a bedroll would spawn um but thank you so so much for telling me about that um and now we have a bedroll so i feel like my next big focus would be to get matches now i don't believe i mean there's a couple of places in mystery lake that i haven't been to um yeah i mean we haven't even mapped out anything of mystery I'm lake starving. which is starving gonna be really bad um but yeah so we now have a bedroll which is really really good um i have to just trek all the way back to the beginning i have a couple bits of deer that i can cook so i will definitely be cooking that and then i still really do think that the ricken will maybe be our next but am i going the wrong way yeah, I do maybe think that the Rickon would be our next sort of like best chance, if you will. Especially because I don't mind that area so much. I had a lot of bad luck or I was just really stupid with the lighthouse when we got our first frostbite in my other series. Um, but yeah, I think as long as I don't make that same mistake again, there is some stuff around there that we could break down for... Um, 
metal and then I just need to gather enough wood around that area to make sure that the furnace or the forge can go for a while. Obviously I need to make sure I take a hammer with this. So I would take the hammer from here all the way through um, Coastal Highway and then because we could also obviously uh, along the way I will search some places in Coastal Highway definitely the garage because the garage is like my favorite place um one of my favorite places the only trouble with that is that obviously there's the bears around there there's wolves that like to hang around there um and then there is also a moose can I take down this rope I've never actually tried that before but can I do that Oh, I'm super curious as to if I can actually do that now. I don't think you can, but I'm gonna I'm gonna try it. I went completely the wrong way. Anyway, it's not important if I can take it. If I can take it down, I will take it down. If not, then not. But yeah, I'm gonna leave this video here so that when we start off the next video, we can head straight for Coastal Highway, which hopefully along the way or there we will find some matches or something because i only have i think about five left on me um i'm gonna cook up this deer meat before we go though so yeah thank you guys so so much for watching this episode and the series i really really do hope that you are enjoying it thank you all again so much for the tips and everything like that i did leave a pin comment i do record a couple of videos sometimes at a time so if I don't get to your comment or if you have said something and I don't like do that in like a couple videos after you left the comment I'm not ignoring <laughs> I just record a couple of videos at a time um, just because it is easier that way um, but yeah now I'm super super happy that we have the bedroll thank you again so much for letting me know that that is a place that it spawns and we have a tin of tomato soup which is good but i don't have a tin opener so here's what it is now can i take this down this whole me wandering around has led to this moment to encumbered oh okay damn it i was really hoping that we could take it down anyway yeah thank you guys so so much for watching i'm gonna cook this meat up now hit the like button leave comments don't forget to subscribe if you have not already thank you again so much for all of the tips and everything and i will see you all in the next video take care bye